in this lecture we'll see how to create users in Django admin and give them different permissions so we have seen this admin panel now let me show you comment it and uh, let me run the server again save it and uh, okay yeah here is our models when we click on the register it gives us an error what is this error no such table block register that means we have created our models but we haven't registered it not in the admin side but in the Django's system so we need to first migrate it first make migrations here the message shown create model register this is the error what we have faced and uh, migrate pool and then restart the server so let's hit the fair enough now we got the registration panel here the button is provided by the Django we need to just define our models register this is our fields which we have created first name last name and email this is our fields which we have created first name last name and email just pay attention we have given null equal to false in three of them fields if we save this then Django will give an error this field is required this field is required and this field is as well required so we need to pass some data over there and uh, Django will give us email validation we need to give email correctly if we haven't if we don't give this Django will again give us an error so we need to pass it always save then it will create it so this is the facility of Django admin this is the feature this is the extensive and distinguished feature of Django we can also create uh, one more user test one test one and test one at the rate test one dot com save it just pay attention here we have created the username test one and test and test but Django is showing register object if we create one more user test two test two test two and let me give the same email okay so again Django is showing register object register object register object this is because we haven't passed any field in this view so how to do that let me show you so we need to register our view in the Django just like this model we need to go in the admin we need to define a class and name it register view we need to explicitly give this this is the syntax and uh, by least display is equal to you need to pass it explicitly your field name first name and last name. okay and you have to register it over here register view and that's it so again run the server cool here just pay attention once again here first name and last name these two fields are only shown over here and email is not showing over there because we haven't displayed the email yet so if we display the email again refresh the page hooray, email is also displayed so this is how Django model works so this is the only brief introduction of Django we'll see in depth about this models and we'll change about this we'll change the views and so many things in the few next couple of sections but this is enough for the introduction of Django models and we'll see Django forms very soon in this lecture we have seen how to create different users and give them different permissions and we have also seen how to use that permission in the next lecture we'll see the how to use that permission